Greetings to my fellow cooperators. It is with great honor and privilege to share our experiences on the CDA's regulations that has helped our cooperative, the Kabampalan, Ilog, and Employees Multipurpose Cooperative known as Kitemko. We always believe that policies provide guidance, consistency, accountability, efficiency, and clarity in all our operations. We utilize the CDA newly implemented online system in updating our operative information shall now be done through electronic operative registration or known as ECOOP RISC and the submission of mandatory reports for fiscal year 2021 through the Cooperative Assessment Information System known as CAIS. We heartily embrace the new online system because it is convenient, efficient, fast, and paperless submissions of our reports to the CDA. Through the CDA website, we can be updated of the current insurances and relevant information which has guided us in all our operations. The establishment of our laboratory cooperative known as Kinjelco was anchored on the Republic Act 9520 in consultations with the CDA personnel. Our founding members have underwent pre-registration seminar on November 17, 2017, conducted by the CDA personnel. We complied with the CDA Memorandum 1, compliance with the Section 4 on the Republic Act Number 11469, otherwise known as Bayanihan to Heal Asu Act to respond to the crisis brought by the COVID-19 pandemic. As such, the member with good standing loans were not deducted for four months. We gave COVID-19 assistance to the members and officers tested positive in cash and in kind, distributed to those badly affected by the lockdown, and organized community pantry through our slogan, Ketemko Cares and Cares. We also participated in the Co-op Kapatid Program and helped organize the newly established IP Cooperative in the city of Kabangkalan, known as Negros Occidental Indigenous People Cooperative, through the inspiration of the CDA Regional Director, Dr. Nora Patron. We facilitated the conduct of the pre-registration seminar on this newly established cooperative. The MOA signing was done on October 22, 2021 with the presence of our very own Regional Director, Dr. Nora Patron, and other CDA personnel who always provide technical assistance to us. We are greatly motivated to continue implementing what was written on the MOA with inspirations of ASIC Vidal Villanueva, who was virtually present on that day. Always welcome the presence of CDA personnel who visit our office on the site of inspections and examinations of the different programs, projects, and activities, as well as partnership with the government organizations. Eight, their presence for the continuous improvement of our cooperative to mention a few annual general membership assembly, partnership agreement between CDA and for the implementation of digital jobs PH programs with Governor Jose Eugenio Lacson and the CDA Chairman Yusik Joseph Incabo. Ketemco Subdivision 2, Ketemco Homes, Groundbreaking, Ayuda Cooperativa, Injelco Study Hub. Indeed, working alone gets things done, but working together brings huge success. A million thanks to the Cooperative Development Authority and kudos to all cooperatives for economic development of our beloved country, the Philippines.